Make sure you understand this application. We are interested in increasing the wood duck population from 400 to 1,000. So we can think of 400 as our initial value. We want to get to 1,000, so we'll let y be 1,000, and that's e raised to the power of k. Remember, that's our growth rate given here to be 6 and 2 tenths percent, so I'll write that as an equivalent decimal. There's our 6 and 2 tenths percent. We want to know how long it will take us to go from 400 ducks to 1,000, so excuse me, we're looking for t here. I want to solve this equation for t. Let's begin by dividing both sides by 400. On the left side, we'll have 1,000 divided by 400, and 1,000 divided by 400 is 2 and 5 tenths, and that's equal to e raised to this power of 62 thousandths t. Now, I've got 2 and 5 tenths is equal to e raised to that power. I'm going to take the natural log of both sides because the natural log of 2 and 5 tenths, then, is equal to the natural log of e to this power. And what's so special about the natural log? On the right side, remember natural log and e, they are inverses of each other. They undo each other. And the right side actually then simplifies to the exponent 62,000 t. The left side is still natural log of 2 and 5 tenths. How do I solve for t? I'll divide both sides by the coefficient of t. I'll divide the right side by the coefficient of t. So of course, also the left side by the coefficient of t. Notice these divide out. And let's go ahead and approximate t then. It is exactly natural log of 2 and 5 tenths divided by 62 thousandths. It's approximately to the nearest whole year 15, and that will be years. So it'll take about 15 years for the duck population to get back up to 1,000.